while a new program may potentially make it easier to park on street sweeping days. An up-and-coming media company invests in L.A. by making downtown its new home, and the very first diagonal crosswalk in Van Nuys gets the green light. All these stories in City Beat. The LA City Council approved a pilot program aimed at reducing the number of parking citations issued for street sweeping. Residents would be informed via a text or online tool when street sweepers have finished cleaning a street, making it safe to park there. The program would be implemented in Woodland Hills and West Los Angeles before potentially expanding to the entire city if successful. A report on the pilot program said it would be expected to take about 8 to 10 months to implement at a cost of $570,000. If the program were to go citywide, initial estimates show that LA could lose between $4.5 million and $11.8 million in parking citation revenue. The pilot program will now go to the full city council for a vote. Mayor Eric Garcetti helped welcome digital media company Me Too to its new headquarters in downtown LA. The company brings a Latino voice and perspective to mainstream entertainment across multiple platforms. It also works with the mayor's Higher LA Youth Initiative to recruit more young people in LA. The mayor said that everyone has a story that needs to be shared and heard. And if you can tell your stories and connect, which you do every single day, Me Too has the power to change the world. City Councilwoman Nuri Martinez and the LA Department of Transportation recently celebrated the completion of the San Fernando Valley's first all-way stop-controlled diagonal crosswalk at the intersection of Sylvan Street and Silmar Avenue at City Hall in Van Nuys. The location was chosen because of the high number of pedestrians that use the intersection. Officials say that the city's other diagonal scramble crosswalks have shown dramatic benefits to pedestrian safety. Officials say this new diagonal crosswalk is expected to have the same safety benefits to pedestrians. The improvements like this will continue to revitalize the community of Van Nuys and making sure that people who live and work in this community get to work and home safely every day.